The following animation highlights the passage of a cystoscope through the prostate and into the bladder. The Urolift deploying device is then withdrawn, allowing exposure of a needle which is then placed through the prostate, deploying a capsular anchor at the external part of the prostate. This is then tensioned and a urethral anchor is deployed. This allows retraction of the lateral obstructing prostate tissue. The same process is repeated on the contralateral side. A needle is deployed, a capsular anchor is then secured, and the lateral tissue is retracted. In my practice, on average, four to six clips are deployed to allow satisfactory retraction of the obstructing lateral lobes of the prostate. The majority of men are managed as day cases, and no indwelling catheter is required at the termination of the procedure. Almost immediate improvement in obstructive symptoms can expect to be achieved with the deployment of a Urolift device. The following animation here highlights pre and post op and how the lateral lobes of the prostate are successfully retracted with the application of four clips.